Hello every pony art Lisiana here, link to my Divinion art in the description below. Warning this video will contain photos from Google, YouTube, Patreon, MNP and Divinion art that is not mine. And here we go. So I want to tell you about the difference between me and Mad Munchkin and I got the idea from one of my subscribers and um, as you can see here there's a grave difference between my OC and her OC. Now I'm a Alicorn and she's a normal earth pony and I know that she doesn't like Alicorns and she doesn't like uh, ponies that is made in pony generator or ponies that is uh, black and red. Now I personally like all OCs and I don't care if they're made in pony generator or what color they are or what gender they are or how old they were when they made the pony or if they don't have a name or if they forgot to proofread stuff. Now I think it's very important to say that I'm dyslexic so I have a very big problem with writing stuff I know and I'm trying my hardest to get better and uh, I also like the factor about something like Fallout Equestria now I'm saying this because it's a read out loud um, st story and I really like this instead of me sitting down and reading stuff I can sit down and listen to it and it I know that you think that it may be not that hard to read stuff but it actually is for me and it also is hard for me to understand something a lot of times but I also have the benefit of I understand others that is dyslexic and I maybe understand how hard it is to come up with a name or it's hard to come up with a OC if you didn't have the pony generator and I also saw a lot of youtubers making uh, great content even though that they only have the pony generated pony so I don't think that you can say that they shouldn't be using it I just and they should uh, you know take more into their name and the creativity of their OC because not all people has this creativity like we do now I know that we in common are artists but I as an artist will love to have pony generated ponies sent to me and people asking for name or for cutie mark or for anything for that matter and I will try to draw it uh, better if they like me to try to draw it better and also yes I will take money for this but they can also go and make it for free in the pony generator so I'm not restricting them for anything and also we don't know if the big stuff, the great stuff is, is started as a pony generated pony I've seen a lot on Divinian art that started like a pony generated pony and then maybe they paid an artist for making the OC in you know better terms or what you could say and then they make it themselves and uh, I even saw some great animation with only pony generated ponies and I also see some great animation where it's drawn by hand now I know how long time that takes and I guess that you also know how long time that takes so I will not go into that uh, the big difference is between me and her that I see all stuff as art so if I see a um, pony generated pony I will imagine it like the OC I want to draw for them and maybe not all artists have this gift 
and I have a tendency to, you know, have a lot of ideas. That's also why my OC is a alicorn and it has nothing to do with anything else. And I also do like the factor of making a Gary Stu or Mary Sue character. Now this is uh, very hard for me to explain. So I will just say that I like uh, characters like that because then you are free. You can do whatever you want with your character. Uh, if you want to, you know, be Celestia's child or you want to be something, just go for it. It's your fantasy. I, I can't hinder you and I don't think that the Mad Munchkin should hinder you for making whatever you want. And I know that uh, most people will probably think this is a bad idea or bad advice to give people because then there will be a lot more pony generated ponies and there will be a lot more Gary Stu's, Mary Sue's and stuff like that. But I don't care, I can click away, I can find great art in just two clicks of my internet. I don't see the great um, problem if if I want to see something different or see uh, great art, I, I don't have the big problem with others imagining being in the, into the My Little Pony universe. I am... I am actually very grateful for having the internet and having the opportunity to make videos every day and uh, be who I am. I n I know it sounds very weird and but there was a time where we didn't have the internet and we didn't have this stuff to um, tell us how to do or what to do. There was a time where we only draw on pen and with pencils on you know paper and <coughs> as I said we come a long way and uh, I, I do really think that <sighs> we should look upon what we have and, and be thankful. I, I definitely am and uh, I would uh, hate to draw in hand again, <laughs> I must admit. I draw on my tablet, so yeah. And I also reference a lot, I know. And I don't know about you, but I really do think that we should be free and we should be able to do what we want with our OCs and we should be free to make it whatever gender, whatever color or make it uh, whatever personality we want make uh, whatever backstory you want because it's your fantasy not mine and not Matt Munchkin's fantasy it's your fantasy and if you can't make it you write to the artist you write to me or you write to Matt Munchkin and you ask them for a name, you ask them for a color, you ask them for a cutie mark and the artists have to say to you if they want to do that or not but I would love to help you make all of this stuff and as I said before I'm taking uh, some money for this but I think it's fair enough and if you don't want to pay money or you don't have the time or you don't make art yourself I do think that the pony generator or other generators in that matter is a great way to you know get your stories out there and uh, that is all I have to say uh, remember that inspiration is right around the corner and uh, remember to have a great day yeah okay bye I would also like to say that it's very important that you don't get offended by others making your OC in other stuff and doing stuff with your OC that you maybe don't like because it's fantasy, it's a drawing, it's... Um, I don't know why she uh, 
it tells you that it's the same as making a building or it's the same as making you know other art your OC is a free pony to make stuff off uh, but if you have copyright for example it's not free so there's the solution for that buy copyright for your OC and then there will be no problems now I don't have the money for paying for copyright on my OC, so my OC is fr for free use. And I try to see others making uh, art of my OC that I don't like, but that's just the way it is. It's art and um, I do f really think that we should be free. And of course I have restrictions if people are calling me and want something done with the OC I don't like but then I can just say no and click away it's as easy as that that's all I have to say okay bye <laughs>